What's going on, beautiful people? It's Marcus back with another video. Hope everybody's enjoying their day. We are back with a book review, man. Like, this is something that I've really wanted to do for a very long time. And it was just one of those things where I had to make time to do it, which was read more books, man. I've been wanting to read more books. I would buy books, start them, but never actually finish them. So I had to prioritize reading books, finishing them, you know, just absorbing information and being able to apply it, uh, whether it's uh, professionally in business or in my personal development, you know, just personal, spiritual all that good stuff man i just needed to make time for it i needed to make make that a priority so that's what i started to do and i finished uh, one of my books man so before we get into it make sure you guys subscribe to the channel hit the thumbs up for us man that always helps us out with the youtube algorithm and that always helps us out man hit the thumbs up for us follow us on instagram twitter and facebook um uh, real quick, as far as the brand, we are working on some new things. Uh, we got a couple of releases coming soon, so stay tuned for that. But back to what we're here for, which is the book review. You've seen the title. You've seen the thumbnail. Building a Story Brand by Donald Miller. Really, really good book, man. This was uh, something that took me longer than it should have. Again, I had to make it a priority to actually read these books. Uh, but this was one that I don't even know if somebody recommended this book to me. Um, but I did buy it off of Amazon and I got it in, man. I was pleasantly surprised of how easy of a read it was. Um, it was very simple, uh, easy to comprehend. And, uh, I just, I thought it was just a really good read, man. I'd really recommend this to anybody that is in business at all or starting out in a business before even starting a business if you're thinking about it i would definitely uh recommend this book this was just a good one just to kind of summarize man um this book he he basically comes with these seven uh very simple elements uh to building a story uh for your brand and um a lot of things in this book um i was able to take away absorb information and be able to even apply it to this brand uh, and some of the things i was already applying and didn't even know it so that made me uh feel a whole lot better uh, about the way we were going in this journey for this for this brand so that's pretty cool you know a lot of the the main messages in this book is in my opinion what, what i took away was just keeping it simple, just keeping your message simple. Make sure you have a story that's beneficial to the customer. Like your brand should be a benefit to the customer. Um, you're not the hero is one of the main things is he used a lot of movie references in this book, but uh, uh, letting the customer know, like you need to have the customer in a position to be the hero and the, your brand or your business is just a guide. Uh, to help them accomplish their goals. Basically, you, uh, your brand is uh, in the serving business. Um, it's what I took away from it. Like you're you're meant to serve and it's not self-serving. You're serving your customer base um, and just making sure that what, it, what you're selling has a story that, again, is beneficial to the customer, man, because at the end of the day, that's what it's all about. Uh, building a community around your brand and um, just and that just keeps it's just, it's almost like a ripple effect oh another thing that he also talks about in this book which is really good is he's he's done a lot of research and finding out why people purchase from certain brands or certain services um, being able to tap in to what people are, um, what what makes people make a purchase, like either consciously or subconsciously, um, is is something neat to know that 
you probably already know but you weren't able to kind of like put a name to it so he was able to do that in in this book and again from what i've taken away from this book man just messaging story you know these these things are are huge and very vital to building your brand uh, without those things it's it's not saying it can't be done uh, but in my opinion is it'll probably be pretty tough because a lot of people these days want to know what they are what they're purchasing and why they're purchasing it so uh, we wanted to make sure that we were doing that on our part and how we are applying certain things in this book uh, to the brand whether it was email marketing i know we simplify email marketing so a lot of our emails are pretty simple straight to the point uh, the website somewhat been trimmed a little bit but uh, we tweak some things here and there to simplify a message um, social media posts text messaging like all of these things um, some some of which I was already doing um, but some little small details that I saw in this book I was like oh, okay I can I can apply that to what we're doing so I was pretty uh, pretty overall glad that I was able to finish this book and uh, yeah, man, this is really one that I will, again, man, just recommend to anybody that's looking to start a business or if you have a business that's already established, this is a good one to read, man. This is a really good one, man. Uh, but yeah, man, I'm, I've, I've already started on another book um, that I don't know when I'm going to finish it. I'm not sure how many chapters in it. Uh, but this one didn't have that many chapters in it. It was only 13 chapters. So like I said, it's a short, easy read. Um, the next book that I am reading is The Power of Positive Thinking by Norman Vincent Peale, I believe the author's name is. So uh, I forgot who recommended that one to me, man. A lot of these books I have, I've had them for a while. And I just, again, man, it's just got to prioritize the time to actually read these books. But now I have a schedule and I'm doing it. And uh, I'm through the first chapter on that first book, on that on that book, uh, Power of Positive Thinking. Um, I'm looking forward to reading the rest of that one because that's really good so far. I really like that book. If you guys got any suggestions for any kind of books, whether it's professional or personal development, spiritual development, um, you know, shoot them, shoot them to me, man. Hit them, hit me in the comments. I'm always interested in, you know, uh, developmental uh books whether spiritually physically uh just or professionally like like i said so that's pretty much it man hopefully i'm able to do these reviews um consistently man i'm i'm happy with the schedule i'm on right now as far as productivity and i'm getting a lot of reading done um, i usually start on these books after i'm done with my my morning scriptures and, and devotion so that's pretty much going to be it for this video man like i said stay tuned we got some new releases coming man we really i can't i can't stress enough how grateful and thankful we are for everybody that's been supporting this brand um is it's been a great a great ride and this journey is to us it just feels like it's just getting started and we're starting to see a little bit of momentum and it's pretty exciting. We're just trying to make sure we stay on top of everything, but being able to document this journey and just take you guys along with us, it's, it is, it's the best thing ever, man. And then we'll look back at this YouTube video and see how cheesy it looked um, because I'm pretty sure it'll be much better in the future. You know, I'll continue to upgrade things here and there, um, but yeah man it's all a part of the journey and uh but that's gonna be it for this video hope you guys enjoyed it please hit the thumbs up for us subscribe to the channel if you haven't already follow us on instagram twitter and facebook and now tiktok as well i need to remember to put tiktok on there as well we're on tiktok and uh but yeah man we'll catch y'all on the next one Peace.